my dear students i am going to take the second part of ninth class science in second part i am taking physical change and chemical change this is a very important topic so my dear students in this part first i am taking physical change first physical change the definition of physical change a change in which physical properties are changed is called physical change my dear student in this change only the physical property of the substance are changed not chemical properties so you have to remember in physical properties in physical change only physical properties are changed uh, more about this physical change it is a temporary change <coughs> my dear student this is not a permanent change this is a temporary change in this change only state of matter change in this change the only state of the matter is change more interconversion of state is a physical change this is also a definition interconversion of the states is physical change and in this change only states of matter are changed what are the matters what are the states that is i have taught you in the first chapter the states of the matter solid liquid and gas in this change states are changed further there is no change in composition of substance substance remains the same i am giving you example you will see in this change substance remains the same and more no change in chemical nature of substance my dear students the chemical nature of the substance will not be changed is not changed in this physical change so this physical change is a temporary change so i am giving you an example see with the help of this example you will see example i am taking a very simple example ice you know my dear students eyes eyes can be changed on heating eyes can be changed into water on heating and water can be changed water vapors water vapors water vapor on heating see this change ice can be changed into water and water can be changed into water vapors on heating and this process can be reversed here this water vapor water vapor see here water vapor again can be changed into water on cooling on cooling see here water vapors are changed can be changed in water on cooling again on by cooling again by cooling again by cooling water can be changed into ice here this is a most important example of the physical change with this example you can understand very well the physical change ice can be changed into water on heating and water can be changed into water vapors on heating but you see my dear students ice water and water vapor are one and the same thing there is no difference 
in their chemical properties because again water vapor can be changed into water and water can be changed into ice only the states are changed in this example only states are changed and there is no change in the chemical properties of these substances so my dear student this is a physical change this is a good example of the physical change you can see here both the process are this is a reverse process in this process cool on heating and by cooling you get all the substance again so this is a example of physical change now i am taking chemical change second chemical change i think the physical change is clear to you now second chemical change my dear students a change definition c definition a change a change in which chemical properties chemical properties are changed a change in which chemical properties are changed a change in which chemical properties are changed is called chemical change is called chemical change this is the definition of the chemical change my dear students in this change you can see physical as well as the chemical properties both are changed you can define like this in this change physical as well as chemical properties both are changed in this also in this change chemical composition of the substance is also changed in this change all the chemical properties of this substance are also changed in this sense states are also changed these are the more definitions or you can say more knowledge about the chemical change so my dear students i am going to take the example with the help of the example the chemical change will be clear to you in day to day life you have seen in your houses my dear students milk can be changed into curd you have done this process daily in your houses milk can be changed into curd but a reverse process is not possible curd curd cannot be changed into milk my dear students here milk can be changed into curd but curd cannot be changed into milk this is the chemical change cannot be changed this is milk cannot be milk is changed into curd but reverse process is not possible curd cannot be changed into milk so this is a good example of chemical change because this example exist in your houses so my dear students i am taking more example burning of a candle second example burning of a candle burning of candle 
here you see my dear students in burning of candle chemical properties are changed after burning of candle it changed into so many other forms so burning of candle is also a example of chemical change because all the constituent after burning if you want to make these constituent again in candle not possible a more example burning of magnesium ribbon magnesium ribbon here my dear students if you burn the magnesium ribbon you will get when magnesium ribbon is burnt in the presence of the oxygen you will get magnesium oxide but from magnesium oxide you can uh, you cannot get again that is ribbon magnesium ribbon so this is not possible so these are the examples of the chemical changes my dear students physical and chemical changes in this chapter both are very important i again tell you the second part physical change and chemical change is a very important topic you have to take this topic very serious seriously and i have discussed with you with the good good examples so i think the concept of physical change and chemical change is clear to you in the last i want to make a request to you my dear students please like and subscribe the channel i shall be very thankful to you